Every week we bring you stories of athletes who inspire us. Our sports reporter Parker Reem tells us the story of the Lincoln softball battery fighting to go to the same college to keep their unique connection going. It's all about the connection. From the time the signal comes in, the pitcher comes set, and the batter is sent packing. The connection between pitcher and catcher is the most important in softball. You want a good relationship with your pitcher and catcher because it's you got to trust both sides of it. For Ava and Gianna Domenici, it might have been fate settling into their roles on the field. I hated putting on the gear. Like I was sobbing, crying. So she ended up taking my position as catcher and I took her position as pitcher in the rotation and that's how it ended up and we kept with it. Yeah, worked ever since, so. Working ever since for longer than you'd think. We're always together, we always work together, so it's really easy to just think about what we're gonna do before the game then execute it during the game. She calls on my pitches in the game for high school, which is pretty cool and I can, sometimes can know what she's calling before she calls it. Because the Lincoln Batteries bond extends all the way back to birth. Growing up, I always had a built-in best friend right across from me on the field to play catch with. That's me. Now, our athleticism never really translated to the field, quite like the Domenices. But with twins, you can't just take everything at face value. Fortunately for their mother, uh, they have been basically working together for a long time and they know each other as twins should be and as twins together. It's been a beautiful thing to watch with them working together as a pitcher and catcher. That's such a unique bond that um, I think makes them really special. The fraternal twins are poised for another great season, chasing a Foothill Valley League title after COVID interfered with their junior year. COVID could not have hit at a worse time from them from a recruiting standpoint. And because coaches couldn't come out and watch us and we couldn't go and play in front of those coaches, COVID temporarily dimmed the lights on the Domenici's dreams of playing together in college. It really slowed things down and became very stressful trying to find a school that would want the both of us and still had the opportunity for us to go and play for them. The senior sisters knew they couldn't break up the band, so it became a priority to put in the work to find the school that would take both of them as a pitcher and catcher tandem. We could not separate. We just, it wouldn't work out going to different schools. We just want to stick together. Ava and Gianna work tirelessly, posting their workouts and pushing themselves for an opportunity at the next level together. There were no days off during COVID. We just had to keep working. And with no one telling you the work, it was we relied on each other. They really show that they can prove to themselves, which is most important, and prove to others that they can play at the highest level. And right now, they've done that. It wasn't until they stumbled upon a local pitching coach that they realized they found the perfect fit. It came to Embry-Riddle is where we're going to go, and they have engineering, which we both want to do. And the coach, Stephanie Sia, was from this area, so we were able to connect with her. I'm so excited that we both get to go to college together, be roommates, <laughs> go to a new place, and explore a new opportunity there. The twins from Lincoln worked hard to get to the next level and now have one more shot to showcase that you know what. People talk about twin telepathy and they have it. They do, they have it. They can just give each other that look, that sign, that signal, and um, that's when the magic happens. So the question is, will the twins be bringing the telepathy to college? We always get asked if you have twin telepathy. It's. <laughs> I think we do. I think we do a little bit. I think we're gonna have to wait for them to make their minds up on that one. Until then, reporting in Lincoln, Parker Reem, 49ers Sack High Sports. The twins say they are thankful they found a school prioritizing education and can't wait to pursue their majors and softball together.